Friends, it's Gregory here with Old Europe Antique Home Furnishings, and it is February 16th, 2023. Got a shipper outside bringing in some cool things. Let's go have a look. And we've got some new items arriving. These are coming in from uh, North Carolina. What do we have here? Got some, uh, got some Civil War swords coming in here, and uh, I believe I had a piece of silver as well. All right. No, that's fine. Well, actually, yeah, let's take, take it on inside. No, we can just find a place in here to set it. Yeah, there'll be a place in here somewhere where we can set that stuff. Yeah, just set it right on up there. Fantastic. Thank you. All right. Also, just want to take a quick second to show you guys some things that came in today. We These are some very old books. They're from 1746. They are in Latin. We got six Civil War swords here. Be very decorative and a uh, antique trumpet vase and this uh, malachite veneered piece has been here before ah what are we working on here Oh, I can't get the party to stick to that right Oh, yeah, there you go. Have a good one, George. I'm experimenting here to see if I can get this to work. Okay, and which piece is that for? The one in the other room? Yeah. Okay. So, Ron, I have to say, I think you've done an excellent job repairing the bottom of this painting there. There was some missing pieces, and there's yeah, one left to go. It's a tremendous painting. It really is. It's this I was really attracted to the color. The this is always tough to do with the water and it's in the slight reflection on these swans. But what really gets me the most about this painting is the movement. You can actually it's done so well you can see the movement. You can see these, you know, kissing, hugging, whatever, the hair being done, this guy, you know, fawning for the girl and this really nice little gazebo in the back. Uh, with a cleaning, this thing would really, really, really snap sparkle. It's a great painting. Very professional. I, I agree. Just... I have just gotten an interesting call from some folks up in North Austin. Apparently, they acquire uh, old storage units, and uh, they've been doing it for a long time. And uh, he said that they have got some furniture, the likes of which he has never seen. He's not even sure how old it is. He thinks that it's extremely old. And I'm going to go over there now and have a look. Let's go. They did all them storage auction things here, te Texas Storage Wars, or whatever it's called. Yeah. I was at auctions with them. And, so um, you've been doing this a long time. 20 years. So yeah. how'd you end up with this particular storage unit? Uh, it was an online auction. Online yeah, auction? Unfortunately, all the auctions have gone to online. It sucks for Have me. they? Okay. Yeah. I mean, if you know anything about the auction business, it ruined it. Ah. Uh, um, made it really difficult to make a living. Oh, really? Yeah. Um, but this is, I mean, this is not a bad little unit. Uh, I think you'll be pretty pleased with the furniture. Well, I'm excited to see it. So tell me what it is about this that you think is different from the stuff that you normally encounter. Um, just, there's a lot of lot of furniture that, I mean, even after 20 years, you don't see everything. Right. Um, and a lot of this stuff I have never seen. Sorry about the mess. This is what it looks like. When you no, that's all. Another what... couple of really nice chairs over yeah, there. Yeah, I see that over there as well. Yeah, looks, uh... More Asian, maybe. Yep. Um, which is also, uh, I wish I hadn't buried this one piece, um, but you can see it. This is absolutely beautiful. We open this up. This this cabinet is. I mean, if we need to, we'll open it back up. This is just gorgeous, right? And this is this is probably. I don't even know. I don't want to guess how old it is. But judging by the hardware on it, it's it's pretty old. Um, okay. And then uh, this they ruined. They whitewashed it. Uh, metal. Metal dressers. Uh, haven't hadn't seen those in a while. So That's interesting. Yeah. Um, there's two of them. So 
um, and, and, and they're solid metal on caster wheels, so I'm thinking probably early 1900s. Yeah, those definitely look like they've got some age to them. Yeah. And then this, this is very unusual. I just, I've yet to come across one with wooden wooden wheels on it. And it doesn't look like a repo to me. It looks, it looks original. I was looking at the hardware and all the way it's put together and everything. There's no, there's no, uh, no screws, no nuts. All done, dove and tail, and 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 um, I forget what they call that right now. It's a blank when they how they get these to sink in. But mm -hmm. oh, I actually do see. I think I do see something right there. Yeah, but those are. <coughs> if you look at the tacks on here. They're not rounded heads, so they're not modern. That is interesting. It's a beautiful piece. And then this this table I love with the with the chessboard in the middle or checkerboard, whichever you prefer. Yeah. It's actually I was pouring it apart a little bit yeah. to get a look at the wood. It's really beautiful wood. Yeah. Really, really nice. Is that a veneer or is that a actual a hardwood top? Yeah, probably a top. Yeah. Is it? Yeah, oh, well, surely this must be a veneer here with the different types of wood. Uh, I, you know, my focus is pretty much European stuff. Okay. So I don't too. I, I don't know much about these Asian pieces, so that's not really my thing. This this is probably American, I would assume. The, and uh, there's a secretary's desk back there. I, I can, like I said, it's a maple yeah. secretary's desk. Okay. Um, I didn't open it up all the way, but we got we got it a little bit open. It's, it's really quite stunning. I mean, it's going to be tough to drawer. see. Can you see all the drawers in there at all? Uh, oh yeah, I do see. I do see some things in there. Yeah, it's it's, it's a complete secretary's desk. Yeah. In really good condition. Yeah, that I'm gonna say that is a 20th century piece. Yeah. It's a more modern piece. Yeah. Than some of this other stuff. This one's got me baffled. I can't. I mean, I. If you look at how rustic this is, and then look underneath at the woodwork. They did. This is this is a very interesting piece. More Asian. Is it another Asian piece? I think so. That is a rolling chest. That's what I thought it was. I wasn't sure, but that's what I yeah. thought it was. And that that is uh that's so, Asian as well, I believe. I have not another Asian piece? I have not seen anything like that come out of Europe. Uh, people keep the weirdest things. Hmm. I mean that uh definitely looks like it's probably got some pretty good age to it. That's what got me baffled. I didn't know that it was all Asian. I, 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 I said, when as long as I have, I, I've not seen stuff like this before. This is all right, new. right, 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 yeah. Um, I mean, I've seen all kinds of furniture, but this, I guess because it is Asian, it's just not something that I... I, I think so, because I'm like you. I've looked at tens of thousands of yeah. pieces, and I just don't I see don't, this. I don't recognize any and, of and, and that alone yeah. probably gives it value, because it's obviously somewhat rare if yeah. we, neither one of neither us one has ever. ever seen it. All right, my friends, well... Just leaving uh, the storage facility here. Unfortunately, there was uh, nothing there that uh, really fits what I'm looking for. But uh, appreciated the call and uh, never hurts to take a look when something potentially special comes up. All right, my friends. Well, we are back at the uh, warehouse here. A little unexpectedly, I got a call. Uh, some more things happen to be arriving. So uh, there's the trailer now. And we're going to go ahead and... Uh, Unload a few things from the trailer. So this is the Breton piece that has just come in. Obviously needs to be shined up a little bit, but that's a really big, beautiful piece. He's bringing in some shelves right now. A lot of things in here. This uh, Breton table sold last week, as did the Breton table back there. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, this piece is sold. Also, this triple pedestal leg table has sold. So all of that's going to be leaving. And this set of eight beautiful red velvet chairs is sold. So there's going to be some things moving out. Make a little room here. There's shelves coming back in here. Okay, so these are some of the other items that came in. Got an Empire style secretaire. 
and these two. And not style corner chairs. Two paintings came in. Obviously St. Mark's Square in Venice during Carnival, no less. And this is Lauterbrunnen, Switzerland. Can't miss that.